Well, it's a windy night here across the state. Let me show you this wind forecast because it is really strong out there right now and it will stay strong for a few more hours. Take a look at the timestamp on the top right of your screen. 11 o'clock tonight. We'll still see wind gusts here across the Salt Lake Valley around 45 miles per hour. Same thing for St. George across the board. Almost all of us dealing with wind gusts around 30 to 40 miles per hour this evening. We'll take you through midnight. Now things are still going to be really strong here across the state. Once we get closer to about 3 4 a.m. We'll see less wind along the Wasatch Front by 7 a.m. And we'll see a lighter breeze across central and southern Utah early tomorrow morning. With that being said, I want to give you an update on our latest wind alerts. So for Utah Valley, you have a wind advisory through 11 o'clock tonight for the Great Salt Lake Desert also through 11 o'clock tonight down into Castle Country. That's going to be until four o'clock this morning for a wind advisory and then over towards Moab through 10 p.m. and for the Uinta Basin. You have a wind advisory and high wind warning that takes you through 10 o'clock tonight. So a lot to talk about with wind, but also a lot to talk about with cold temperatures behind today's cold front. So tonight we're going to have hard freeze warnings for some of our higher mountains, either tonight or tomorrow night, depending on where you are. But this does include areas like Park City up through Morgan, the Ogden Valley, and then up towards Garden City and towards Ephraim. Overnight temperatures will be chilly. We are going to see a chance for a few scattered showers, but nothing widespread for precipitation. Come tomorrow afternoon, we'll see a few more chances again. So partly cloudy along the Wasatch Front for early tomorrow morning. Temperatures around 40 degrees, mid 40s by 10 a.m. But highs tomorrow will only be in the 50s, low 50s for many of you. So overnight temps 7 a.m., low 40s for Salt Lake, Tooele and Ogden. Eagle Mountain dropping into the 30s. Highs tomorrow in Salt Lake 54, Ogden 56, Provo 52 degrees. St. George, you are comfortable tomorrow at 77 for a high, 80 on Saturday. By Sunday, 88 degrees, you're going to have temperatures close to 100 degrees and in the low triple digits by next Thursday at 101 here in Salt Lake. We have quite the heat up as well. Temperatures in the mid 50s for Friday, mid 60s for Saturday, 70 by Sunday. Then take a look at next Thursday. Those temperatures are going to be back into the 90s or right near 90 here in Salt Lake City. I also want to point out the temperature come Friday night, 38 degrees. If you have any sensitive vegetation, especially if you're on the benches, you're going to want to make sure that you're covering those plants or bringing them inside. Some cool nights ahead, but we'll warm up starting Sunday into next week.